Owners of oceanfront properties in Imperial Beach are being told to clean up their yards or they're going to have to pay a hefty fine. But many say that's easier said than done. And 10 News reporter Rena Nakano took their concerns straight to the city manager and found he's ready to listen. Many people who live along this new bike trail here in IB say their privacy is being compromised. We get all kinds of wild birds out there. For the last 22 years, Lynette Goman's backyard has faced the National Wildlife Refuge, but now she gets this. Job, bro. <laughs> Since construction on the new condos just south of her apartment began a few months ago, Goman says her quiet life along the estuary drastically changed. A new bike path along her backyard was paved. Then a new fence was put in. A lot of looky-loos. And now she's got a new set of rules. Keeping things clean and keeping debris down and, and overgrown weeds and some of those things down to a minimum. Last month, about 27th Street residents whose backyards now face the new bike path received this code compliance letter from the city. The message, tidy up by May 20th or get fined. <laughs> I do what I can and that's it. Gomand is 70 years old, living off Social Security. She says there's no way she can manicure the lawn by the city's deadline. I'm not putting anything else in it. If the city wants more in it, they can come and put the more in it. I don't have that kind of money to pay people. It's a general cleanup in the community. City Manager Andy Hall says he wants to help. Perhaps we took a wrong approach. Maybe what we should have done is have a neighborhood meeting first. After our interview, Hall went into the neighborhood and spoke to residents. He set up a community meeting for May 19th and suggested working with the Sierra Club for help. We hope that this summer we'll be able to bring them in. In the meantime, Goman says she'll try her best. You can only do so much. Secretly wishing that she didn't have to. Progress must go on, I guess. Rena Nakano, 10 News. The community meeting is set for May 19th. The city manager says as long as the residents proactively work toward cleaning, the city will be flexible with the deadline. There is an